Go, Bess, go! Bess, go! 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 Alright guys, we gotta wash your feet before you go inside. Your dirty feet. Good girl, Bess. You're a good girl, yeah. You gotta get the clean feet. Let me see. Back feet time. Almost done, Bess. Last foot. Alright. Go! Go, Bess, go. <laughs> thank you. Very good, girl, Bess. All right, Bess, come here. Come here, let's go. My mom just called me upstairs. She says that, Bess, she says she's got a smoothie for me. <laughs> what a greenie. A greenie, Bess. Bess is so excited. Bess, you want to sip? Come here. Hmm. Tastes like Taco Bell. So this thing tastes like a fruit smoothie, but apparently there's like lettuce, tomato, cabbage, butternut squash, all kinds of crap in it. It's the healthiest thing I've drank all year. All right, Bills, we got something else to do. It's not gonna be your favorite thing in the world, but it's something that needs to be done. But it requires something that you really like to do, which is going outside. We're gonna go outside, Bills, yeah. Come on. All right, Bills, are you ready? Are you ready to get this crocodile? Are you ready to go? And get it, Bears, get it! Now give me that back! Give me that back, Bears! Give me that back! This mine! This my crocodile! Go! Up, up! Good girl! The Bears is gonna be getting a bath! The Bears hates bears. You hate Bears, Fuse! Where are we? This is in PetSmart? So we're at this place called Pet Value and apparently you can go in here and you can wash your own bales. So we're gonna go try to do it because Bales hates baths at my house but every single time I bring her into PetSmart to get a bath, they're like, oh, she did so good. So I wanna see if I do it myself, if she does so good. Bales, hey, are you gonna do a good job? Do a good job, let's go, come on. They're just so excited to get a bath. This is crazy. So I guess we gotta put the best head in here so she doesn't move around. All right, she's all strapped in. You ready, Bills? It's warm. It's warm, Bills, it's okay. Good girl. It's not getting too hot because that says hot, that side. Yeah, it's I don't know like, it's gonna get too hot. It's just like warm. Okay. All right. Good girl. She's doing such a good job. Gonna just do that a piece to get her head. <laughs> no. Oh no. Hang on. Oh, All right, good girl, Bills. Good girl. Up. Good girl, Bills. That was awful. <laughs> that guy was such a jerk. He was like mad that I was filming, 
and then we went into the back aisles after we were done washing her. We were gonna look for some food because she needed some more food. And he walks over near our aisle and just like stares at us to make sure I'm not filming. He was like mad that I didn't ask to film first before I was in the area. I go to pet stores all the time. I'm always filming and no one ever cares. I don't know why it's such a big deal, but he was like super mad that I was filming. Then he was watching us the whole time. He must not have liked the videos. The videos did a good job, dude. So it cost 10 bucks, which is actually pretty good because usually when I take her to PetSmart to get a bath, it's 30 but they definitely do a much better job than I did. So, I don't know. She did a good job though. She did a much better job than when I wash her myself. Good girl, Bios. You did a good job. I'm actually starting to go crazy thinking about this whole experience. Like, I have no idea what that dude's deal was. Like, he was so mad. So basically what happened was we went in, we washed bales, everything was great. The girl was over at the counter smiling, and then we walk out, and there's a guy at the counter all of a sudden, and I'm like, I'm gonna go around the store and I'm gonna look for some food really quick before I pay. He goes, okay, but I don't know why you were filming in there. You can't just film in there, and I don't wanna see you filming in any of the aisles of the store. And I'm like, okay. You know, like if he had a problem with it, he could have manned up and told me while I was washing the bales, like, hey, no filming, but he didn't. Anyways, whatever. So I'm like, okay, I'm sorry about that. I didn't know that that was the rule. And then I go and I start walking around the store with bales. And as we're walking through the aisles looking for the food we want, I turn around and I see him literally I see him literally following us around the store with his arms crossed, angry, just staring at me. Like mainly not staring at me, but staring at Bales. Like he was just gunning Bales with his arms crossed, mad. And so I feel like he just doesn't like Pipples. I feel like he's just got a problem with the sweet Bales. With the sweetest girl ever, yeah. So that really made me mad. Like I was mad once I started to realize what I think was going on. Because he was literally just gunning Bales. Like he was pissed. I don't know why. He was so mad. All I was trying to do was show off their cool DIY. It's like a unique way to wash your dog. I've never even heard of that before. Anyways, we're never gonna go back there, right Bales? No. And I left them a two star review. All right Bales, it's that part of the morning again. I got a very important question for you. Wait, hey. Does she want, hey, wait. Does the Bales maybe want, does she want yummies? <gasps> You want yummies? Do you want these? Do you want yummies? Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. All right, you're going to have to sit, and now you're going to have to stay. <gasps> good girl! <coughs> That's a good girl. You're a good girl, Bills. Oh, yeah. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Nom, 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 nom. Let me see. Let me see some of those yummies. Let me see. Yeah, you can have these ones for waiter bears. You can have some breakfast. And then you guys can have some lunch over here. And then you guys can have some dessert over here. Oh, yeah, the bears has got a big old souffle of yummies. Thank you. So the bears got her yummies first. Good job, bears. Now I'm going to have my yummies. I got these freaking, what are these things? We got these Lucky Charms Fruity Boys. Look at those things. Oh, my God. I'm so excited to try them. Oh. Merry Christmas, bears. That was good. I hear Isaac coming home. Isaac's coming home from school, Bales. <gasps> there he Hi. is. <laughs> What's going on, dude? Hi, Bales. Get you. Oh, yeah, Bales. Get it, get it, get it. Get that bed, Bales. Get that bed. Get the bed, Bales. Get the bed. Get the bed, Bales. Go get it. I'll go get it back from her. No, give me that back. Get it, Bales. Get it. <laughs> get him 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 go and get him 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 we have been searching for Sprite Cranberry for the entire time I've been here, about two weeks, and we haven't been able to find it. Now, I didn't know Sprite Cranberry was a big deal. I saw all the commercials because they're like on all the sports channels, and I've always seen Sprite Cranberry at the Puppy Bad Boy store. But the Bales and I, we never thought to get it. We didn't really understand the true mimosity of this product until I got here. Where I saw it in my brother's drum room, and everybody went crazy in the comments, like, oh my God, Sprite Cranberry. So now, we've been searching for it at the store, and it's literally sold out at every single store. So one of my brother's friends, whose name is Keegan Johnson, said that he has some. And so we're gonna go, and we're gonna go, and we're gonna taste it.
There he is. <laughs> is that? Oh, dude, Wait a minute. That's John Cena. Gomez, go, Gomez, go, Gomez, go, Gomez, go, Gomez, go. Gomez, go. But this is all I have left. Dude, he's got the last swig. Oh my, he's got the zero. What do we do? Like, where's the three shot glasses? Uh, we're not gonna all, sorry, we're not gonna all do it together? <laughs> all right, screw it, here we go. <sighs> that's pretty good. I don't know if the hype is real, but that's it's pretty decent. good. It's decent. It's pretty good. It tastes like cranberry flavored soda. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. What's going on? I'm What's Keegan. going on, man? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet this you. This is Bales. I know, I've seen her before. <laughs> oh my, look at that cat. Jeez. Oh my god. That is so funny. Is Bales, go say hi. After uh, opioids. <laughs> Who's that? Who is that? Who is that? Hey, come on. Come on. Good girl. All right, well, that was great. Thank you, Mr. Keegan. I really appreciate it. Nice socks. What are those, Bales? Come on. Come on, come on. Bez is like obsessed with the cat. All right, see you later, man. He even let me keep the bottle. <laughs> my own souvenir. My first and last Sprite Puppy Crayon. It just tasted like carbonated cranberry juice. Could you agree with that? Yeah. All right, so now that we're all Sprite Crayoned up, we are here at this brand spanking new Puppy Bad Boy Taco Jimothy James Association and Learning Center. Bye, Bez. So this taco gym has always existed here, but it burned down about a year ago, and they recently opened it back up. This is what we got. We got this beautiful, gorgeous bad boy establishment. We got the sign, and it just comes with this clown in the front yard. All right, let's go inside and check it out. All right. Let's eat. I gotta say though, like, I kinda like the other one we usually go to better. Yeah. White Bills? Great Bills, yeah, the Bills is like, yeah, because every time we go to that one, I always get a little bit of yummy stew, and you basically didn't get any this time. Like, for some reason, the whole time we were in there, everybody was staring at us. Like, I don't know why. When we walked in, we were trying to decide what we wanted, and she was just staring at us the whole time with her arms crossed, like, hurry up and order. And I was like, bro, I gotta decide, man. I gotta decide if I wanna eat a Bell's taco or if I wanna eat a Titus taco, you know? All right, so another reason that we came to that Puppy Taco Gym Association is because it's right near my grandma and grandpa's house, and we gotta go see him. We gotta go let the bear see him, and we gotta go visit. The bear's gotta see your great grandma and great grandpa. <laughs> the bear's just like knows how to go indoors. She knows she's gotta run up the steps and go inside. Hi. What is that? <laughs> bear's gonna get a little meatloaf. That's it, it's already Whoa, gone. That's a magic trick, Bez, good Whoa. job. Okay, so Isaac's gonna show us a magic trick, apparently. I've never seen him do a magic trick before, but apparently he's a magician. So, he's gonna be using these dice. Tell us what you're gonna be doing. All right, so I have all these dice here, Yeah. and I can make them to be whatever number you want. Really? So they're all just starting out at one, so I just chose to start at one. So whatever number you wanna do, really? I'll just give it five magical shakes, and it'll turn to that number. <laughs> okay. Hey, Bez, mm -hmm. what number should we make it? Give me paw. All right, she's gonna go with a 21. Can you make it equal 21? Yeah, I can. Are you sure? There's no way. Maybe, probably, no, 100%. All right. So I'm gonna put the magical lid on. Yeah. And once again, five magical shakes. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, and. Should we get a drum roll? All right, go. All right, so we got 5, 10, 13, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Really, dude, what? 21? Wow. You ever seen that one, Pops? How'd you do that? So this knife right here is something I sent to my grandpa probably like 10 years ago. And he always sends me a picture of it, like every year. And he's like, Caleb, don't worry, I'm still using it. He opens his mail with it every single day. It says, number one grandpa. You got, it, you got it when you went to the Grand Canyon. Yeah, I got it at the Grand Canyon. Don't tell my other grandpa. And then my grandma's got this plant right here that apparently doesn't take any dirt. 
you just put the plant right here and then you can just water it and it just grows. Apparently that's alive. It's an air plant. When she comes here again, she's going to want meatloaf. <laughs> Which, I don't know when that'll be. Thanks, Thanks for coming us. over. I should have cooked you a dinner, but I didn't. didn't yeah. I? We, were, we were out in the, out and about when you called. We had a spontaneous trip anyway. Taco Bell. So. It was? Okay. Yeah. Go, yeah. Bears, go. Bye. Alright, Bears. We're home. And you know what it's time for? <gasps> You know what it's time for, Bills? Yummies! All right, Bills, we're gonna get you yummies. Come here, I have to ask you a question. And that question goes something along the lines of, does she want, does she maybe want, does she want yummies? <gasps> does she want some of those yummies? <gasps> does she want yummies in the tummies? <gasps> does the Bills want yummies? Does the Bills want yummy time? Go, does the Bills want ultimate yummy season? Go, go. The Bears want ultimate yummy season. Yeah, okay, Bears, here's yummies. Have them all. <laughs> here, Bears, have the whole bag. Yeah, have them all, too. <laughs> Good girl. No, hey, wait. All right, Private. Private, come on. Now sit. Now sit. Now sit. Now sit. Now sit. And now you got to stay. Good girl. Good girl. Very good girl, Bears. Very good deal. Yeah, you want some dinner? You just want some lunch? Noob. All right, so it's about 12 in the morning right now, and it's a school night. Isaac's got to be up at 5, and he's over here. He's playing RuneScape. We've been playing for like a couple hours. The Bells is coming to see what the noise is all about. She's like, what's all that ruckus? Good for you. She want a treat? All right, the Bells can have one more very special treat. You got to wait. You going to give me a paw? Give me a paw? That's a good girl, Reeves. Yeah, very good girl. All right, well, this is the ghost story, Clebosaurus Rex, coming at you live with the bales jumping on the futon adventure. We're going to end it here. Basically, right now, we've been playing RuneScape for a couple of hours. Just been playing with Isaac, trying to get as much scaping in as we can. And now it's time for me to go to bed. So we got the bales right here. And Bez, what do you got to say to them? Did you enjoy your bath today? The Bez is like, you know, I didn't enjoy the bath, and you know, I didn't enjoy the facility, so it was just kind of like a crappy bath, but it was a cheap bath. It was like a $10 bath, and at least you got to give it to me instead of that weird guy that keeps giving it to me at Pets Point. Right, Bez? Right? Yeah. Yeah, this is a good girl. Oh, thank you for the kisses, Bez. All right, well, with that, I want to thank you so much for watching, and I will see you on the puppy next one. Look, we got this boss helmet. Boss helmet, see what I say to come slash the club before they sell out. They're going to be gone forever. <gasps>